In this problem, we want to make some calculations for a grinding wheel. The first part of the problem asks us to find the angular velocity of the wheel in radians per second. Now we actually are already given the angular velocity of the wheel, but in revolutions per minute. So this first part of the problem is just going to be a simple unit conversion. First I'm going to convert from revolutions to radian by using the conversion factor that states that one revolution is equal to two pi radians. So these revolutions will cancel out and be replaced with a radian. And finally, I'm going to use the conversion that states that one minute is equal to 60 seconds. So these minutes will cancel out and will be replaced with seconds. If we put this into our calculator, we find an angular velocity of about 230.4 radians per second. So that is the angular velocity of the grinding wheel. Part B asks for two things, the linear speed and the acceleration at a point on the edge of the wheel. Now there are some formulas we have for this that we can look up in any textbook. First, for the linear speed, the linear speed is equal to the angular velocity times the radius, or the radial distance from the point of rotation. So we already found the angular velocity given in part A, and for the radius, well, we're not given the radius, but we are given the diameter. So to find the radius, we'll just have to take that diameter, 0.35 meters, and divide it in two. So if we put this into our calculator, we find a linear speed about 40 meters per second. So that is the linear speed. And then for the linear acceleration, Again, this is something where there are common formulas for it that you can look up in any textbook. And the one that I'm going to use, the simplest one in my opinion, is the one that states that the acceleration is equal to the square of the angular velocity times the radius. So again, the angular velocity will be the same value we found in part A, and the radius will be the same value we used in part B, 0.35 meters divided by two. If we put that into our calculator, we find an acceleration of about 9,300 meters per second squared. So that is the acceleration. That's it for this problem. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please consider subscribing as it'll help me out in making more videos like this. If you have a question, leave a comment down below and I'll do my best to help you out. If you have a request for a future video or you'd like to hang out, my Twitch page and my Discord server are linked in the description below, so check those out if you'd like. But that's all for now, and I hope you all have a lovely night. Bye-bye.